The homepage for Slicata is https colon slash slash www.sldcada.disa.mil. This is the start page for Slicata. You can log in by either clicking on version 23 login at the top or version 23 login at the side. Either place will take you to the same home page. You will select your non-email certificate. Accept the consent notice. The first time you log in, you will be prompted to load your PKI certificate. This is a one-time thing. The only time you will need to reload it is if your computer is re-imaged or you receive a new CAC. To enter your time, you will go to My Time in Attendance. Go to the Type Hour Code to select the code of hours that you're putting in for regular time. It would be RG. Enter the number of hours of time that you're putting in for that week, day by day. If you have a week with more than one type of type hour code, you must add a new line for each type of hour code you have. You can add a new line by clicking on Add New Row. When your time totals are correct with the appropriate hour codes for your time, you will click the EVT box for each week and hit save, which is the floppy disk icon. To enter a leave request, you will click on my leave request. To add a new leave request, click on Add New Row. Put in the date or dates that you are requesting leave for. The number of hours you are requesting leave for. And the type hour codes you are requesting leave for. Any remarks to your supervisor, you may enter in this box. Once again, go to the floppy icon, click Save. When you have the save was successful, it has been entered. To enter an overtime request, whether it's credit hours, overtime, or comp time, you will go to the left-hand side, click on My Overtime Request. Once again, go down to the bottom, click Add New Row. Put in the day you are requesting the overtime, the number of hours, the type of hours, and you must have a justification. Once again, click Save. To enter a prior pay correction, if there was an error on a previous time reported, go to the left-hand side of the screen. If it's not in the previous pay period, you must open the Search Set Selected Date window select the appropriate pay period ending week, hit search or apply depending on your screen,
highlight your name, right click to prior pay corrections, or you may go at the top, do the labor drop down screen, and prior pay corrections. Make any changes that are needed. And once again, click the Save icon. A supervisor will be able to see all pending tasks under the My Task screen certifiable employees, employees with pending leave request, employees with pending overtime request. To certify your employees, click on certifiable employees. Their time card will appear. If their time card is filled out correctly, you may click on the TNA cert mode, accept. To cert week one, you would click the cert week one button. CERT Week 2, or CERT Both. Certification was successful. To approve an employee's leave request, open the Leave Approval window, click on the down arrow, and you may approve or deny. Once again, click Save.